Hey folks, Juan Rochefa here, CEO and publisher of REITmagazine.com and realestatesuccessmagazine.com. And we'll bring you a couple more editions of the magazines this month of July. And I want to wish you all a very happy 4th of July. Uh, be safe, don't get burnt. Uh, what's going on here? Well, the themes this month for REAP is weather. That's right. And we're in the midst of uh, hurricane season here in South Florida. Uh, we're on the East Coast. And, uh, well, we're not the only ones that are affected by weather. The Midwest, you guys get tornadoes. Up north, you deal with the frigid uh, winters. And then out west, you guys deal with uh, monsoons, uh, droughts, earthquakes, you name it. Um, anyway, it all affects us how we deal in real estate. So this month, our contributor month, Pete Youngs addresses that issue. He talks a little bit about the different areas of the country and uh, what the deal, what the deal is uh, on each one of them when it comes to real estate. So um, be sure to check out his article. And then on the success side, we are looking at the uh, social media craze. That's right, YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, LinkedIn, you name it. Whatever's out there, people are on it and using it. Well, it's affecting the way we do business today. And so it's affected the way we do our business. Uh, some of our businesses, we had to hire a consultant to ha help us with the social media. And uh, we've been asked her to uh, join us on uh, the Success Magazine side. And she has uh, done so, and that is Jennifer Hampton. She's also this month's Contributor of the Month, uh, talking about her specialty, social media. So uh, she'll be uh, contributing on a regular basis about social media, so be sure to catch her. And also catch her this month on this month's free webinar. Uh, we'll be entertaining her as uh, she teaches us about uh, social media and how, how to use it to improve our business. So be sure to check her out this month. Also, uh, this month I will be in the Death Valley Desert, that's right, um, going for some more heat. Uh, I guess we're looking at about 120, 130 degree weather out there. I'll be there with Frank McKenney as he uh, goes to pursue his fifth Bad Water Ultra Marathon uh, completion. He's done it four times and now we're going for a fifth and this time we're going for a record. Uh, now he's just doing it to, to break records and this and that. He's doing it to um, bring... Um, awareness for his uh, charity, the Karen House Project Foundation. So be sure to check out the links that are coming up here um, and uh, see if you can donate, help them out as uh, all the proceeds go towards uh, helping the folks out in Haiti. Uh, right now he's, uh, he's already built 12 villages out there, self-sustaining villages, and he's out there to do more. Um, he did a lot for them after, immediately after the earthquake and he's providing supplies and food and shelter, temporary shelter. Now he's going back out to provide the real stuff. Uh, like he likes to do. All right, and then uh, you'll also be seeing a new uh, project that we're coming out with, uh, our own nonprofit, Landmark Community Services here in West Palm Beach, Florida. And with that, we are looking to uh, create a community resource center to help folks that are in foreclosure uh, or dealing with that type of distress of their home uh, through a nonprofit. And uh, we're seeing a lot of success on the nonprofit side, so we're uh, going to do the same thing there. So you'll be uh, hearing some more about the uh, Pepsi Refresh Everything project, a uh, you know, grant that they've got going on, and we're going after it. And so we'll be looking for your help to uh, help us uh, get the votes we need to, to get the uh, grant money to get us uh, off and running. So that's it for this month, and we want to thank you for uh, tuning in again. And enjoy all the articles, great articles again. Our contributors never fail us. So enjoy, and uh, have a great rest of your summer. And uh, this is Walrus Jump signing off. God bless.